All right, can we go see Storm now? Like, seriously? Let's go. Let's go already. Let's get a move on. It gets good 20 hours in. Still can't wait for that uh, remake of Final Fantasy VII and the fact that you're going to have to buy it in, like, six different parts. Oh, Steven. I'm going to love it. I want no part in it. Great. No part in it. It's what every Final Fantasy fan has ever wanted. I forgot. Still no release date for uh, Kingdom Hearts 3 it's either. Not coming. Yeah. It's going to be a year without it. No announcement, no, like, idea. Next year, maybe. And honestly, dude, like, here's the thing. I always have a problem deciding whether I like Kingdom Hearts 1 or Kingdom Hearts 2 more. Because even though I like the worlds in Kingdom Hearts 2 more, and I like the battle system more in Kingdom Hearts 2 more, the story isn't as good as the first one. Uh, well, first no, one was simple. The, yeah, the first one, everything was so new and exciting, though. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Right. By the sequel, you know what to expect. But they made it so convoluted because they put ga mini games in between the games, you know? Mm -hmm. It's ridiculous. It's fucking ridiculous. It is. <coughs> Which I know eventually you're going to put Chain of Memories on your list now. I will. And it'll be fantastic. Except your version of the game will be harder. And I won't be able to do it. And then and then we're fucked. <laughs> huh? That's the only thing I'm worried about. But theoretically, if you beat one version of it, you should be yeah. able to do Oh, yeah. I don't really think there's much of a difference between uh, the PS2 version and the PS4 version. It's probably super optional bosses or something that we're probably not going to do, or... I That's not what I wanted to know. You're not going to get any mail from me, you fucking bitch. <laughs> Because everybody's asking what's the difference between the GBA version and the PS2 version. Well, I'll tell Lots you. of it. Lots of it. The way it looks, the way... Everything. It's like a completely different game. I just want to know what the difference is. <sighs> what's the difference? Probably not that much. I mean, it just, it'll look better than... That's about it. They give you a third mode where you play as Mickey. I don't really know. No, they just keep talking, talking about how the GBA version is different than the PS2 version. So I'm assuming the PS3 and 4 versions are exactly the same as the PS2 Probably. version. I don't know. No extra that stuff. That game, I know that you don't really care for it, but I... It was addicting. Well, Sora's part, anyways. I like fucking getting moving yeah, points Riku's part and kind getting of falls cards apart because they're like, that, oh, you can only have these cards. Yeah, and every world it's the same. You know what I mean? It's just a different deck, but you got the same deck for that whole world. Yeah. And there wasn't a whole lot of, you know what I mean? At least with Sora, you could set up different cards and do different special mm -hmm. attacks and all that stuff. And I just, yeah. I love collecting, building cards different and decks and adding to big combos, you know, and stuff. I loved it every room you chose what room you wanted really you know what i mean as long as you had the right card you go like, yeah let's make this uh I make this a save point i can make this whatever a hidden treasure or whatever yeah. you, you don't you don't have to do every room cuz you're picking the rooms <laughs> so just find the yeah. find the path you want to take and take it in the least right. amount of time you want to and if you if you get stuck you can always go back to another world and farm it yeah do whatever I, I used to go back to Aladdin's world a lot because mm -hmm. when Aladdin, you could do a special trick with Aladdin where he'd slice people up and give you Mookle points and you buy mm -hmm. cards of decks with Mookle points. Like, right. Fucking yeah. love it. Like I said, there's there's good parts about it. It's just I think the card-based system is what threw me off it's because, weird. yeah, it's it is weird. weird. It's weird. It's hard to get used to. But I, I got used to it. And I was like, this, is, this was a neat little thing to try. Yeah. Sometimes exploration can be a good thing. Mm -hmm. And it was in that case. I'm still trying to figure out whether or not I should do Birth by Sleep. I really should. I really well, should. Why don't you... I just, I don't want to do it three times. You know? Eh. Well, you're going to have to. I know. Huh? And I have to do it in order. And the problem is I've never beaten uh, well, Terra Story. It's a good time to start. Yeah. Well, hell, um, no, I can't. I can't even give you a copy of it for you to play it. No. I only have it for the PSP, which my PSP is busted, by the way. That's busted. Yeah, the battery ex like expanded, so now it doesn't fit nice. anymore. Nice. 
And at this point, you're almost better off buying a PS Vita than you are buying a PSP battery because they're so expensive. Mm -hmm. I have one of the original PSPs, like the old, 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 old PSP. So PSP. finding an old battery for it is like expensive as you fuck. Got a PSP. Yeah, you know me. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> bitch. Bitch. Where is it? There's something over here. There it is. <clears throat> Fucking silly. But yeah, I have it for uh, PS3 and PS4, so that doesn't really help you. Well, instead of pawning it off on me to do it, why don't you try to... Since the one, the, since the first mode you never beat, and it's first, you just you try it. <laughs> and if you can't do it, then you be like, well, fuck it, you know, and then mm. maybe I'll look into it down the line. I don't know, maybe if I put Terra's on the easiest setting... And then, like, do the other two on a higher setting, I'd be all right. Because I do, I normally do normal for the other two, but, man, Terra, people love his mode, too. Uh, but he's built like a tank, so yeah. he's really super slow. I mean, he's just, I don't know, like, not very, <coughs> not very good. Yeah. Dude, after all we've been through together, you're really going to still treat us like fucking commoner peasants? You go <laughs> fuck yourself. <laughs> fuck you. Fuck you. Without us, the princess would be fucking dead. So show us some gratitude. So I and Jen uh, watched the movies recently. Mm -hmm. um, and they're both movies that you've seen. Um, Are they? The one movie I still can't believe, after rewatching it a second time, I'm like, I can't believe I went with you to see that movie in theaters. Because that was not a movie to go see in theaters. But we watched Your Highness. Yeah. Well, I don't know why we went. I think it was Brock's idea. Yeah, Brock wanted Let's to go. Let's go fucking. Yeah, like, it's easily something we could have waited for it to come out. <laughs> Brock and his leg. Okay, now, get, take the penis off. It's funny <laughs> yeah. the first time, but. It is. It was. I, I like for the rest it. of the movie. You just I like the movie, but yeah, that was getting ridiculous. Him having that on for the rest of the movie. <laughs> did what did Jen think about it? Um, she didn't like Jen. Yeah. What did you think about your highness? Okay. I liked okay. it. You looking at him? No, you are looking at me? Like, <laughs> oh man. I know for a while the two of you were uh, quoting that one line where it's like the wind, the the wind on your tits or something like that. To, like, what? There's I don't a, there, there's a that. thing where he's talking to Natalie Portman. Is he trying to be romantic? Like, it's it. Yeah, oh, I vaguely remember it. I wonder if that's on YouTube. Because <laughs> the I wind licking your now. tits or something like that. Like, <laughs> yeah, that is something we probably would have quoted. <laughs> I can't believe Natalie Portman agreed to do that. She just won an Oscar. She could have done anything she wanted to do. Well, you know what's and that's really, what she chose you know what's to do. Really crazy. Their father, the guy who's playing the king. Yeah. He's um, in Game of Thrones. No, he's not. Yeah. <laughs> Who is he? Um. I don't remember uh, the the uh, uh, Tyrion's father. No, he's not. Yeah, he's the father. He's not the... their dad. Yeah. No. Yeah. <laughs> fucking, yes, he is. He's fucking not. I feel like this movie came out before Game of Thrones. Yeah, 2011. Yeah, it was like right when the first season was airing. It's a wind I called know. wind licking your tits. <laughs> yeah, fucking Charles Dance. Yeah, he was the king. That's fucking <laughs> Oh, man. And he dressed just like the guy from Game of Thrones. That's why I was like, holy shit. Look at where we've come. Prepare for the fucking thing. Yeah, prepare for the fucking thing. Yeah. Yeah, it was good. Yeah. <laughs> I only watched it that one time, but yeah. it was a good yeah. movie. I did enjoy it. <laughs> uh, it was. <laughs> it was different. <laughs> uh. And then we watched uh, Eternal Sunshine of the Spot. Yes. Yes. Now the problem here. Yes. <laughs> Tell me you loved it! Jen, come here. Tell me you loved it. <laughs> you had to have loved it. No, she had some problems. No! Well, I'm going to tell you straight off, you're wrong. And it's okay <laughs> to be wrong sometimes. There, no, Jen made some valid points. There okay. are some First problems. Of all, we're going to we're gonna discuss this next, oh, next episode. Time? Okay. Because I can't get into a five-minute debate <laughs> when we've already reached... 
the end of this. Yeah. Okay. Good. So we're gonna we're gonna pick that up right next pause time. Pause it right here. Yeah. We're gonna pause it right there. We're gonna continue this romantic theme between Brock and this bitch <laughs> as I'm arguing about one of the remote, most romantic, tragical movies I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> we'll see you guys next time.